what's good fight fans we're back with another one in this time we have the training session of one of the highly skilled fighters george Camboza jr george Camboza jr he is an australian professional boxer who is known for his aggressive fighting style and he has been a fan favorite athlete after his victory over teofimo lopez he you can also say he got name and fame after his victory over george Camboza jr he is the former champion Kamboja Jr. is a former champion so Josh Kamboja Jr. fighting style is aggressive and technical sound fighting style he combines a strong punch output with a good footwork and defensive skill and Josh Kamboja Jr. he even trained he even used to be sparring and training partner of the Manny Pacquiao the greatest of all time so Kamboja Jr. poses a good power in his punches, especially in his right hand. He often looks for opportunity to land powerful hooks and straight punches to hurt his opponent. Counter-punching combina combination punching, he, pro he is proficient in throwing combination, often th following up his initial strikes with follow-up punches. Kamboja Jr. looks to overwhelm his opponent with a fast and accurate combination. And footwork and movement, Kamboja Jr. is utilized. He utilizes his effective footwork to control the distance in the fight. He can swiftly move in and out of the range, enabling him to launch attack while avoiding his opponent counter strike. While avoiding his opponent counter punches. So, what's your thoughts about George Kamboja Jr.? What do you feel about him? What do you think about George Kamboja Jr.? Um, I like to tell this early. Just think, you know, I'm just thinking about that. Juwante Davis vs. Jose Kamboza, how cool that match goes. Man, that fight is going to be a banger in my opinion. Um, what's your thoughts about that? Let me know in the comment section below. So if we have to talk about the defense of Jose Kamboza Jr. While being an aggressive fighter, Kamboza Jr. also pays and attention to his defense. He uses his head movement, shoulder roll and upper body maneuver to slip incoming punches. Additionally, he maintains high guard to block shots and minimizing the damage and conditioning endurance. Kamboja Jr. is known for his conditioning and endurance. He has displayed his ability to maintain a high work rate throughout the fight, allowing him to sustain his attack and put constant pressure on his opponent. Um, it's important to note that I've been saying his fighting style and the fighting style evolve and adapt over the time of the over the time, you know, over the time period, fighting style might get changed after his loss against Devin Henney. He hasn't fought till this day and when he fight he might fight you know he has said there's and bigger news in that he might bring a better version of himself the new fighting style but currently he his fighting style i have already described to you so some of the key characteristics of his fighting style kamboja jr is known for his high energy and work rate inside the ring he constantly press forward and throw high volume of punches putting constant pressure on his opponent and Kamboja Jr. is skilled at throwing combination often unleashing rapid fire punches in succession he mixes with punches well targeting both head and body of his opponent to wear them down. Kamboja Jr. he became lightweight champion after his victory over Teofimo Lopez and he lost his title against the current champion Devin Haney. So counter punching uh, George Kamboza Jr. has great counter punching and effective jazz. Kamboza Jr. possesses a strong and accurate jab, which he had, which he uses to set up his combination and keep his opponent at the bay. His jab serves as a versatile tool for both offense and defense. Um, if we have to talk about the defense, while primarily he is known for his offensive output, like a, he has a solid defense, he is capable of slipping and countering his opponent attack. So. Kamboja Jr. exhibits a good footwork and ring general shape. He moves well around in the ring using his angle and lateral movement to create opening and avoid being a stationary target. His footwork enables him to control the distance and dictate the pace of the fight. Conditioning and endurance. Kamboja Jr. is known for his excellent conditioning and endurance. He has shown the ability to maintain the high level of activity and intensity throughout the fight often outlasting his opponent so what i was saying at the beginning you know i've been watching this boxing and i've been analyzing a lot man just think about this fight you know no title match okay maybe the winner will get the title shot a fight between george Kamboza jr and juvante tang davis trust me man 
that fight is going to be a banger. Javante Davis is known for his knockout power and while George Kamboza is known for his aggressive fighting style, this fight might go back and forth battle. Um, you know, George Kamboza Jr. hasn't been knocked down in his career. Maybe, I, I feel like he, has, he hasn't been knocked down in his career. Trust me, Javante Davis. I know, I feel like it's going to be an easy fight for Javante Davis, but that fight is going to be a banger. Anything can happen. This is the fight him, Joe Scumbler Jr., who is known for his high work rate, and Javante Tank Davis, who is known for his fight IQ and knockout power. Trust me, man. Just think about this fight. Just think about this fight. Joe Scumbler Jr. versus Javante Tank Davis. Trust me, it's going to be a high PBP. Not highest PBP like maybe like Ryan Garcia versus Javante Davis, not high, higher like that. But it's going to be a high PBP. It's going to be a great battle between two of the best lightweight in the world. And this battle is, trust me man, this battle is going to be a banger without a doubt. So fight fans, we have came to an end of this video and I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you leave a like and if you are new to this channel, hit that subscribe button off for more boxing athlete workout video.